Before you start using your reference images, you almost certainly need to make some adjustments to them. Here you have the picture of a building taken in the medieval city of Montpazier in the south of France. When you take a picture of a building from the street level, the building's vertical lines will appear to converge to a point higher up. The closer you are to the building when you take the picture, and the bigger the distortion. You can make perspective adjustments using an image editing program such as Adobe Photoshop. Most image editing programs have the same tools. First, crop an area of interest around the building. Use the Zoom tool to enlarge the picture. If your image editing application has rulers and guidelines, use those to frame the building. This gives you a visual reference as to where the building lies are not exactly horizontal or vertical. Use more guidelines if necessary. Openings such as doors and windows make good references. Depending on the image editing application you are using, you may need to unlock your background layer in order to make changes. The process can be as easy as right-clicking the default layer and choose to make an editable layer out of it. Next, you correct the perspective. The Distort tool is a good tool to make these types of adjustments. Once you are satisfied, commit to the changes. Adjust your guidelines again around the building's perimeter. Crop the area of interest using the guidelines as a reference. The file is almost ready to be saved. You may elect to do additional adjustments, such as remove the little girl from the bench. Zoom in on the girl and use the clone stamp tool. Most image editing applications have that functionality. In this case, sample an area to the left of the girl near the bench. If you are using Photoshop, this is done by alt-clicking a spot. Paint over the girl. Zoom back out and save your file. Alternatively, you can resize the image file before saving it. If you do not have an image editing application, this edited file plus three more building facades have been provided for your convenience. In part two of this project, you start working in 3ds Max.